In the beginning, we set out to create a documentary about cinema, but unfortunately all of the doors to the cinemas were closed to us. We decided to take a different approach. We went out onto the streets to meet new people and to discover what stories they had to share with us. To see if the heart of cinema lives on in them. These are the people that we found and this is what we discovered. I experimented with many different approaches of writing. Like, uh, do I do it stream of consciousness? Do I outline things heavily first or that kind of thing? And I found that a project where I'd been outlining heavily in a structured way, it just, it never came alive ever. And it was always so boring. And like what we were talking about earlier with the uh, uh, Keats and the negative capability, I think that's why I like poetry so much is because writing it was an act of exploration. Negative capability is the, um, the state of mind where you're, you're kind of at the limit of your understanding and your kind of comfort with ambiguity. And obviously Keats was uh, romantic and a big part of the romantic movement is about like uh, these great forces of, of nature and like these uh, heroic narratives that give your life purpose and meaning. And uh, a big part of that is, is the unknowableness of, of life. Of course, that was in opposition to the, um, you know, like the Enlightenment thinkers who thought that you could just figure it out and you could just, yeah, scientific, all that stuff. Um, and yeah, so I, I feel like writing where you discover, it's, that's the only thing that's really worked for me. And I think the stuff that I've made, which is still hardly anything in the grand scheme of things, but the stuff that I've made that connects with people has all been made in that mode mm. it's not to say that great stuff can't be made in other ways i don't know enough about how stuff has been made to know that but just personally for me it needs to be an act of discovery what led me to london was romantic love but love of what you're doing or you know it could be love of the place it could yeah. be love of a job um but you know i think talking about cinema actually the first film i ever saw um, that my parents allowed me to see was Metropolis by Fritz Lang and a sentence that really uh, stuck with me from that film uh, was the mediator between the head and the, and the hand is the heart and I think it's a really important I mean there are sentences you know that really mark you in life and that's definitely one that marked me so it's always nice to have the heart as a mediator between what you think and what you do. So I knew when I start my stationary brand, I will have Rumi quotes everywhere because people need to know more about Rumi and his story. I think it's fascinating. And actually people connect because people buy something and it's like, oh, Rumi. And even if you don't know Rumi, his words are so powerful and so magnetic that even all the century later, you know, it's someone that you know could have said those words and you know that's the power that I love about quote someone years and years and centuries ago would say something that could resonate with someone today how amazing is that I mean it's crazy that people don't use quotes more into their life people think oh yeah quote is cheesy it's extremely powerful you have an amazing brain that shared something for free with you it's the power of words you know, someone can tell you something and you can think about it for 20 years. It's exactly what happened to us today. What yeah, you see exactly. is thinking you. You were walking around, didn't know what you were looking for, and you, boom, bumped into Ruby, right? I would maybe suggest, um, you know, one, at least once in uh, every person's life to just go to the library, get a poetry book, go alone in, in, in a field maybe in a summer day open the book and let yourself be guided and transported you know in another world by poetry i think you know poetry is not read, read too much uh, in those times you know and uh, maybe something more rediscovering 
Many doors closed in our faces, but many more people and places opened up to us. If the cinemas had opened their doors to us, then we would never have met all of these beautiful people. The universe had something better to show us. So we pulled on the thread to see where it would take us, and this is where it led. There is a thread that links us all, through storytelling and humanity, to the source of all creativity in life. We only needed to open our eyes and adjust our lens to see it.